last session with the keynote. And we've actually never done this before at a boot camp with a, a sort of fireside chat, although there clearly is no fire. Um, we, we have with us Pierre Amidar, who is the founder of eBay, and I'd like to ask you to come up here. Um, Pierre obviously has created one of the great companies of the new economy, and I, I thought it would be a, a great chance for us to have a sort of personal interaction in front of 600 of our closest friends. Um, and we'll also have some opportunity to take questions from the audience. But you have created such a legendary company that we wanted you to get top billing and you know, just spread as much knowledge as you can to this audience. So uh, I would like to just ask you a few questions and we'll just have a back and forth dialogue. Um, I guess the first question I should start with is, tell us the inside story of the formation of eBay because we've always sort of read the you know, journalistic interpretation of what happened, but tell us the real story of how it happened. Right, right. Well, uh, you know, um, in, in every story that you read about in the press, there's definitely a grain of truth. Um, <laughs> and uh, the, the whole story about, uh, you know, my wife uh, starting uh, with her Pez collection and uh, talking to me about how great it would be to have a place to meet Pez collectors. I mean, that is definitely a media-enriched story. Okay. Um, it is, uh, you know, it is, uh, it, by the way, is there any press in the audience? Uh, no, it isn't really. Okay. None that would get this inaccurate. Okay, great, great. Um, it definitely has an element of truth, but, you know, I started eBay actually five years ago to the day, today, uh, September 5th, uh, it was Labor Day, five years ago, 1995. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> and, uh, um, so, so does that mean you're fully vested? Is that what you're yeah, Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I think we had four. We had four year best. Okay. Um, but uh, you know, at the time I was working at General Magic. I was a software engineer working in the developer services group there, and uh, um, I had always had an interest in, in financial markets, and the whole concept that an, an efficient market uh, could be used to, to reach you know efficient prices for goods. And I was frustrated that individuals were not able to participate in the most efficient markets. So it was really kind of an intellectual thought experiment. Mm -hmm. I thought that with the web, with a global uh, medium, we could create an efficient market that, uh, that individuals could finally benefit from. So that was kind of half the idea. The other half was the collecting, you know, collector idea. Put those two together and uh, launched a 